All right, part sorting. And then if there's another stage in this row, we'll do it. And if not, I'm not sure what I'm doing. Combine these. They are under the twin sword. They're the ones made out of, entirely out of kanji. Well, I can sell that. Um, where are you, twin swords of kanji? There we go. And their special ability is Ghost Edge Power Up. Or no, it looks like Ghost Edge Duration Up. Interesting. They're much stronger than my uh, martial artsing hands, but I want to stick with those for a bit. Um, going down the list real quick. Uh, Versago Greatsword will kill the old one because they're identical. Uh, Ale Strike will be combining this with the level... Excuse me, with the level 18, and then the level 7. Level up. Asterisk? Is asterisk like a snow element, or is there something else at work there? Don't know, but let's combine them. Yes, it is... Brinical damage? Boo right. Oh well. I'm not quite sure what that means, but from the little uh, symbol, I would say it is ice damage, which really tempted to try that, but I'll wait. The twin daggers. The swords. Is that everybody? Is that everything? I think it is. Yep, okay. Off to guns. Um, they're both plain. I can get rid of one. We will combine that with the Build Strike Gundam Full Packages weapon, which it'll be under rifles, Rob. Kanji Beam Rifle. Looking for it. I'll need to combine those two Lupus Rifles. There it is. Okay, it looks like the one I combined it with had poison, and this does not. So the elements don't seem to carry over. Interesting. I have to remember that. This is weird, but I like the elemental damage thing, though. I really actually do, so... Man, that is an improvement. Uh, loses me some kind of gauge increase, but, you know, I think I'm gonna do it. Because damage! Damage is king. Except when it's not, when you need skills and things. Oh well, if I have to go back to that, I will. We'll see how it comes out. Uh, Peacock Smasher. I know there was something I needed to combine. We'll find it. Lupus. I needed to combine Lupus. It's kind of a, it's kind of a uh, tough balance, because you may lose whatever the skills were, like bonus damage, which it looks like I do lose for this. But I also gain more equipment slots, which I kind of need. Like, I'm pretty sure skill slots go by rarity level. So I'm going to have to do that if I want to uh, have the most uh, things on a thing. And I do want things on my things, so... Um, okay, we're near the top of the list. We'll go there and go down. Okay, we're combining a pair of Justice Gundam heads. Um, further down, further up. Justice, there we go. Um, don't need to combine the Strike Noir heads. Don't need to combine the Stargazer heads. Going down. Gun archers left over from last time. Musha Mark II, those don't need combined. I do want to combine the Hyakushiki Jaegers, though, so we'll do that. There it is. And that gives us uh, option part DPS, which, nice. And I think increased par parts break chance as well as uh, hit points, so... I'm really tempted to use that, because... 
I lose option part gauge, whatever, rifle DPS, hmm, that's a thing I don't really want to lose. And I also lose a blade antenna. It's a few more hit points, and, but I don't know. I really don't know. Tempting, but maybe next time. That ups health a lot, but again, not sure. There's a lot of good options, and that's a good thing. Um, let's see, moving on through this, we got... Uh, I can just ditch the old Musha Mark II torso for this. Um, at least in this one, it's pretty easy. I can go by the numbers, and we'll definitely be combining that... Uh, F91 tor level 20 F91 torso into the purple one. Where are you? There you are. Let's see. What does that give me? Uh, it loses me uh, repair on parts break flash system and whatever the th one that says something about death is. Also loses me a psycho frame, but I gain a biosensor. Uh, option gauge and option charge, uh, plus 100% of whatever that is, a uh, bunch of health, wow, a lot of health, and give ups my repair on hit. I think I'm going with that, because that looks pretty nice. Anybody else want to join this party? But yeah, I think what I gained is definitely worth more than what I gave up, so that's... Okay, those V2 assault torso or arms do need to combine. The perfect Gundam arms are, of course, new. And regardless of stats, until I've learned Godfinger, I will not be moving off of this. So that's how it is. And where are you? V2 assault is right here. Okay, managing this stuff, like I said, this this gets really tough to do, but. Level 19 Tall Geese 3, that's not new. Uh, Serpent is not new, that's from last time. Destiny, uh, looks like I'll be combining a bunch of things with these purple Destiny arms. Gonna be combining some Mushin Mark II stuff from the look of it as well, but where are you, Destiny? There you are. And combine it with the green ones. And that should do it for that, and I'm almost done with arms. At which point I'm just about done, I think. And we'll move on to another stage. Greatsword DPS, so sure. Okay, and... Would up my melee DPS, but... Mm, I'm good right now. Again, still need Godfinger, so... Let's see... Yakushiki Jaeger, those two are the same level, don't need them both. Mushas need to combine, and I think that's the ex extent of what needs done under arms. Legs, uh, high new Gundam, they are new. I don't know how high they are, but they're definitely new. Uh, God Gundam legs, keep what I got. Impulse Gundam legs, keep what I got. Musha Mark II, no point in combining... Um, the legs I'm using are not really anything fancy. I lose a little bit of health, it looks like. Or health increase and option DPS, which, man, that option DPS really is doing me some good, though, so I think I'm going to leave that alone. Um, let's see. High new stays. Yeah, Rosen Zulu, yeah, option part DPS comes from that. I have to keep it for now. Because that healing, oh man, that healing. Yeah, we'll stick with what we got. Backpacks. F91 backpack. That's entirely new. Didn't have one before. A lot of skills on my Sananju backpack. I don't think that's going anywhere anytime soon. Um, Musha Mark IIs don't need combined. Hyakushiki Jaeger. That's going to uh, stay where it is. Um, okay, those GP1FB backpacks do need combined, though. Wait. There it is. And yeah, I get a uh, universal boost pod. I already had that. Plus a lot of hit points. Not bad. Tempting, but no. Because it would... Yeah, I think it would do away with my option. 
No, it wouldn't do away with my option DPS, but eh, I'm good with what I got. I'll stick with it for now. Be nice to get a Sananju backpack to go with that, but any new shields? I don't think I got any. Nope. Builder parts. Let's see, can this use... This rifle cannot use the shot range skill I was using. Oh, but it can use Meep. I have no idea what Meep is, but I kind of want to try Meep. Uh, something about limiters. Oh, I bet it's the uh, I bet it's the uh, F91 skill. Hmm. I'll go back and learn Mirage at some other time. Let's learn. Let's see, uh, I had the Barrage, and I had something else that I apparently no longer have, which I've forgotten. Oh yeah, the hyper, the Megasonic thing. Which, uh, let's learn Meep. Let's put that as my X skill. And let's try, um, let's see, uh, let's try Split Force and see what that does. I think it involves your aura, but let's find out. Any option parts? Yeah, Mega Machine Cannon in the F91 torso. Right, let's do another stage. Um, that's the... No, that is a new rebreak stage. Anything new? No, Chapter 4 is still not there. I wonder if it's making me go back and do a hot spot, or if I have to do go through this with my regular folks instead of uh, Tsukimi and Misora. I will find out, and when I find out, I'll do the next mission. But for now, uh, let's take some damage. Oh, I get to have Misa and... Uh, Robota with me on this. I'm going to go see if I can make any decent changes to Robota before we take off. Uh, SD module, SD assembly. Oop, he's still learning this Musha body. He's still gaining proficiency in it. I'm not going to touch it until he's done with that. Ah, uh, but eventually I will have to make him into that, which... I don't think that's Bakunetsumaru, but it's close. Man, I kind of like it. Uh, but we'll stick with that. Can I do three modules yet? Nope, just two, and I'm going to stick with uh, Recovery Support and Treasure Hunter, because, yeah, Treasure Hunter. I want treasure. Let's go! And drink. Pardon me. Well, the back, uh, the backpack, and the head uh, retain the uh, pattern I started with, and everything else is changed. Okay, let's see what we got. I got two attacks. I got meep. I got healing. I've been told that ma machine guns and Vulcans are really good for keeping your uh, boost up, so we'll try that. There's three of them. We're in trouble. Let's switch to the machine cannons. Okay, well, so far, uh, so good. Ow. Ow. Ah, thank you, whoever did that. Okay. Strike freedom parts, I'm all for it. Okay, that's what that skill does, which is, uh, aura splitter, I think it is, or force... Whatever it is, it's... Ah, Gen Sword 3. Whichever one it is, it's pretty good, so... I think it does extra damage based on how much of an aura you've got built up. And it does pretty good. Man, it really does like to pull the enemy apart. That's great. Denon's on parts, Gen Lance. Another Gen Lance. Jinx parts. This is going to be good. Ow. Healing, and back to this. I'm just going to stay on healing, considering what this stage is like, and switch to the machine guns when I'm ready to burst, because... Ah, Gundam Double X backpack, so I've got satellite cannons now, if I didn't before. And... hey. Hi. Well, didn't knock your legs off. That's a first. Green Air Degan head. It's time to meep! 
Well, no, it was a bad time to meep, but... Yep, it's the F-91's, uh... Uh... Multi-image thing, after-image attack, so... Oh well, I got a charge in for it, which means it'll, you know, it's one level, it's one more step towards proficiency. Which, hi, you're gigantic. Well, you're an, uh, XS Gundam, so. Okay, let's charge this, and it's called Split Force. Oh, that's why it knocks things apart, it's designed to split them, of course. Well, I think, since I've got, uh, Yep, I've got red. Split Force! Yep. It is designed to take people's legs off their body. Ah, oh, Lightning Gundam! Cool! Yes, was talking with a friend and uh, said one of the things that... Uh, ah, Power Jim Cardigan. So a lot of Build Fighters try stuff here. But yeah, somebody was saying they'd really like to see the next game... Time to meep! To do uh, transformation you know, transforming mobile suits, if they could work out a way to do that with, you know, mobile suits with a bunch of parts, different parts. I think it might be able to be done. I'd like to, I'd love to see it happen, but, ah, that's done. And there's the Shin Musha Gundam, which was too far away for that to be of any good, so. I'll build up a new charge. I've got a charge, I'm kind of unhealthy, I'm healed, and hey, hi, how you doing? Oh yeah, yep, took his legs off. Oh, that is a skill I'm going to have to keep keep on hand, especially when I'm punching above my weight like this. And it charges quickly too. I don't know if that's a function of it being a relatively low level skill. Or a function of me having a bunch of special abilities, and I also don't care. Okay, hi! Another XS Gundam. It's, of course, short for Extraordinarily Superior Gundam, but I'm sorry, it's the XS Gundam. So much backpack. Got its Beam Saber, which I'm not sure... It says I had it before, but if so, I'm pretty sure it was a very low-level one, so... Oh, that is a fantastic attack. I have no idea what you just said, but I hope you enjoyed it, Robota. Let's see. Let's Godfinger him. Yep. Bye! More powered Jim Cardigan parts. Stomp! Next. Next is way this way. Also happy with how much uh, power I've got on the thrusters right now. Stop beaming me. I'll get to you in a second. I just need to build up a full charge so I can knock your legs off. Okay. There you go. Yeah, that, that Split Force is... Whether it's Split Force or Spirit Force, but I think it's Split Force, that is great. Okay. I think I've got him, yep. I swear the Power Jim Cardigan has a Gundam Thunderbolt backpack, but or some of them have. I'm not sure, though. Bye. Oh man, that is great. That is great parts breaking stuff. It seems like the martial arts moves are really good for breaking parts. Sorry if I've been kind of quiet today. I hope I hope my volume my mic volume's good. I hope you're making me out. If not, I will try not to mutter quite as badly next time. Apologies. Just kind of uh, kind of tired and want to make sure I had a, uh, another week of Gundam Breaker in the can for you guys before I ran out of time. Okay, let's let's go meep. I'm sorry, I I don't know what it's actually supposed to be, but meep. It's meep. I love that it's meep. I love that the Gundam F91 is a roadrunner. That's just the best thing. Well, half a roadrunner, you know. Okay. Let's 
start building up aura for my next split force. Plus, these guys are big enough that they are really easy to hit when they're down. It's great. Okay, what have we got coming in, and how am I going to blast it to bits? I might go burst and see how well the machine cannons are at keeping it up. Aren't you nifty? Let's do that. Well, I tried to use Split Force, but I'm not sure it did anything. Godfinger! Man, they are really good at getting around me. And those machine cannons were decent, but they were not great at keeping me down. Okay. Ah, rescue successful. Okay, apparently that's the first time I've rezzed any of my friends. Was that a gold level part? Yes, Dryson Unicorn Head in gold. I just need to get up to a red aura and then hit you with split force, and you will, you will regret it, buddy. Just you wait. Like this! Well, didn't knock his legs off, but it sure did do pretty good. So, I need to watch my friends and see if I need to heal them, because I'm holding up okay, but I don't think they are. I'll have split force again by the time I've got my red, so, yep. Or close enough. Didn't do anything, huh? Heal Misa. Is this a machine gun? Oh, that's why I can't use those skills. It looks... It looks like a... Uh, it looks like a beam rifle, but it's actually a machine gun, I think. Probably a beam machine gun. Yep, beam machine gun. Let's use the machine cannons a little bit. Okay, let's get charged and use split force on it. Almost there. Oh, are you down to a torso? You are. Bye. That was nice. And the full armor double Zeta again, which, again, still looks kind of like farts in Japanese. Or possibly futs. This is fairly well known, but of course the hero of Final Fantasy nine, or no, excuse me, five, is always translated as Bartz, but his his name in, it was actually supposed to be kind of like German, and it's Butz. B-U-T-Z. Okay, let's meep. Let's meep and move in. Misa needs healed. I can't do it right now. I'll keep an eye on her and see if I can help. Just trying to get enough of an aura up to hopefully blast this dude to bits. I don't know if it did anything, but... I'm doing some damage. Okay, when somebody's in the uh, air, that F-91 cannon does a pretty good job of uh, juggling. I think it's time for me to repair, though. Okay. Just waiting to have a full charge, and then I've got a full charge, and split force for you, buddy. Goodbye. Yeah, man. Shakushiki parts and break DS parts, and... Just waiting to get another charge. Let's heal my crew. I kind of needed it too, so no, no sin there. Okay, I've got split force up. I just need to get a full aura and wait for an unguarded moment. Got the full aura. Ow! And that was the unguarded moment. And I'm healed. His guard's down, so pretty sure she just used her burst action. Okay, it didn't work, huh? It seems like there are some times when Split Force doesn't work. I'm not quite sure when. I mean, obviously one's going to be when you don't have an aura, but I had a, uh, had an aura. As soon as I've got a red aura, I'm using it again, too. 
gotcha. Don't think it did much, if any. Oh well, Godfinger sailed right under him. Machine guns for you. Oh, I've got burst mode. And I've got meep. Burst meep. Seki Hateng Kyoken, let's go. Not bad. Almost got him. It looks like you can't be in the middle of a combo for Split Force to work properly. That's good to know. But we did it! Alright. Let's see. 14,000 points. Learned. Hyper Mega Cannon from the Faz Backpack. Neat. Learned Burst Action Twin Satellite Cannon from the Gundam Double X Backpack. And got a new, uh, I believe, I think Robotub probably uh, gained his proficiency because I have a new uh, uh, SD Support EX Action. Okay, Hyakushiki Beam Rifle. I'm taking all the greens and combining them, as usual. S Gundam Beam Saber, level 18, yes. Uh, Musha Gundam Sword at 20, sure. Pretty sure I've got enough Shikis, take the 20S. GN Sword 3, oh yeah. Uh, Strike Gundam's Armor Schneiders in blue and green and up to level 20, very nice. Dead End Glaive at level 19, sure. A pair of rare GN Lances, definitely. Uh, Shiki Beam Rifle, not sure if I have a higher level one or not. I'll take that uh, rifle. And this is the Beam Machine Gun for the Power Gym Cardigan. Heads, Dryson, Gold Rarity, oh yeah. Hyakushiki Jaeger again, Gan, Power Gym Cardigan, Musha Gundam, Kubali Mark II, S Gundam. I have, I'll take that in case, Strike Freedom. Jaeger, Break DS, Musha Gundam, uh, Gundam TR5 Hazel Torso, that's an interesting one, Hazel, oh yeah, that one that I can never pronounce, the Faz Torso, Jinx Torso, and Hyakushiki Jaeger Torso, Arms, Shin Musha Gundam in purple, Denonzan in purple, or was it blue? Uh, Perfect Zeong, green. XS, two level 20s, Violent Custom, Denonzon, Shiki Jaeger, Break DS, and Shin Musha. Perfect Zeong and XS again, Denonzon, Freedom Gundam, Shiki Jaeger, Break DS, Power Gym Cardigan, level 20, and Musha, just in case. Zeong, Jinx, Break DS, Shin Musha, Gun Tank! Uh, Dual Gundam Salt Shroud. Is that right? Yes, it is. Uh, Break DS. Powered Cardigan. Shin Musha. S Gundam Booster Unit. Rosen Zulu Backpack. Oh, it's even Rosen. Very nice. Um, Lightning Gundam Backpack. Shiki Jaeger. 18 Goof. Level 20 S Gundam Booster. Level 20 Faz. Yep, it does have a high mega cannon or hyper mega cannon on the backpack. Violent Custom Gundam Double X. Oh yeah, 007 Sword G. Uh, Shiki Jaeger Break DS Power Gym Cardigan and Shin Musha and Plastics. Yes, please. And a side weapon optimizer. Sure. I get that. I bet that causes like option part DPS. And we're getting a cutscene. Well, looks like the arcade's oh, uh, closed and boarded up. Well, that's a story thing we're not. Uh, I don't know about yet, so none of this happened, everybody. Will something gunpla battle something something something. Can I? Nope, it's a movie, so. I'm pretty sure we have reached the end of the uh, DLC battles, that being the case. Uh, if so, I'm going to check how many videos I have in the can, and if we have done five in this session, then I will call it. I think this is four, but I can't be certain. 
I may call it at four, to be honest, because I may just go look up how to unlock the next chapter. Okay, well, we had a conversation, and I think we... Yeah, these are the credits, which I'm... Something about a hundred years? Okay. I guess this is like a hundred years in the future or some such. Yeah, let me just check the mission counter because that'll let me know how many I've done. Yeah, we've done four. Um, yeah, that one's still not... Can I change out? No, I can only change... I can't change who. I can only change whether or not they come with me. So, and I, it says I got a gold rating on that one, so... Maybe I have to go back and get golds on the other ones. I will try that off camera. That is going to do it for Gundam Breaker 3 for now. From your perspective, we should hopefully be back tomorrow. But if not, I will do my best to get this going again as soon as I can. At any rate, until next time, everybody take care and have fun. Later!